A quick puff early in the morning. For these young heroin addicts, their first shot serves as breakfast. The first thought of the day is where to score the next hit. 25-year-old Kelvin has been using since he was 18. He started when he was still in school. You feel so good, you just, uh, nothing is disturbing you, no worries, you don't think about anything, you're just thinking about the height. That's all. Health officials say there has been a distinct increase in illegal drugs since 2011, as narcotics transiting the country started winding up on the streets. A hit of heroin can cost as little as 30,000 Ugandan shillings, or about $8. Former drug addict turned activist Cyrus Malcolm says addiction is just one of the dangers. As a need and stranger team program is not allowed in the country and uh, most of the drug users don't know that when they're injecting drugs they're exposing their lives to the risk of HIV transmission. His organization is lobbying for a needle sharing program and for treatment programs for addicts that are currently not available. Don't wait for rehab, the whole campaign is here to break. Activists launched a new education campaign last year dubbed the Hook Campaign, warning teenagers of the dangers of narcotics. The middle class have more money and all that, so they want the next high. Now they want to surpass alcohol and get into the cocaine, the heroin, and it goes as far as you can imagine. But kicking the habit can be difficult. I've seen people who have stopped, but stopping will, will involve uh, changing new friends, lots of stuff. And in a society where former drug addicts face massive stigma, quitting may be just the first challenge. Sergio Rosblatt for VOA News, Kampala.